Hey folks, welcome back to another great episode of Old Car Guy from the Archives. Today we're going back to Groundhog's Day 2018 where we installed a brand new gear reduction starter on the old Doba, so stay tuned. So, we've got the uh, starter that we're going to be putting in to that. Alright, so here we are on Sunday afternoon. We're going to be installing a new uh, gear reduction starter in this car. Uh, the old one that's in there now is like an original style. It is fairly new. It's only a few years old, but it's, uh, it's a slow turner. So when it starts, it sounds really long and whiny and dragged out. So we're going to do a quick start so you can hear what that sounds like. Well, that's the sound that we get on a typical Dodge uh, that was probably made from ever until they come out with a lot of the fuel injected stuff. They all sounded that way. The starters, they just dragged and dragged and dragged until they finally caught. This gear reduction starter is going to turn the engine a lot quicker upon startup in hopes that A, it starts quicker and uh, it doesn't sound so long and drawn out. So today, this is what we're going to do. So first thing we got to do is uh, get the battery cable disconnected and get the car up on jack stands so we can get underneath of it. All right, so we've got the car up on jack stands, and the reason why we've jacked up the driver's side of the car is because the starter is attached to the transmission bell housing on the driver's side. So we'll show you where that's at. So there's the old starter attached to the transmission. Got a couple of transmission cooler lines attached to it that we're gonna to have to get out of the way temporarily to get that thing down out of here. So now you can see the power connections and we'll get the tools to take those off. So here you can see the size difference between the original style on the left and the gear reduction on the right. Another big difference is that the one on the right weighs a heck of a lot less. So let's get it in. All right, so now we're going to uh, reconnect the battery cable and make sure she starts, I guess. And there you have it. There's a condensed version of the uh, gear reduction starter being installed on the old Cordoba, the 1979 Chrysler Cordoba. You'll see this coming up in some future episodes where we may be installing some EFI on this project as well. Guys, thanks for sticking around. Stay focused on the windshield, not the rear view mirror. God bless. We'll see you in the next video.